adverbs. In this video, you will learn what are adverbs, different types of adverbs, and the words as you can see quickly, slowly, tomorrow, outside, yesterday, often, how these words which we use in our daily life are going to be used in the sentence to make it more meaningful. So first of all, let us see what is an adverb. An adverb is a word that modifies verb or an adjective. It tells something more about a verb. For an example, Ram is running quickly. Here you can see I have highlighted the word quickly. Why? Let's read this. In this example, Ram is a noun and the word running is a verb. The word quickly is an adverb. It tells more about the verb running. Let's see another example. The lion roars loudly. Again, I have highlighted the word loudly with the red ink. Why? Let's see this. In this example, lion is a noun and the word roars is a verb. And the word loudly is an adverb. It tells more about the verb roars. Always remember, an adverb never describes a noun or a pronoun. It describes a verb or an adjective. An adverb tells how, where or when an action happened. Now let us see the types of adverb. Adverb that tells how. Adverb that tells when. Adverb that tells where. Now let's see some words which will come under the each category. Adverb that tells how. The words like slowly, neatly, quickly, loudly, carefully, quietly and easily. All these words tells us how an action happened. Now let's see adverb that tells when. The words like yesterday, today, next year, next week, soon, tonight, later. These words tells us when an action happened. Now let's see the third one. Adverb that tells where. The words like outside, inside, upstairs, nowhere, somewhere, here. These words tells us where an action happened. Okay, now let's see some exercises in the form of sentences to understand it better. I'm going to take the examples, exercises for each category so that you can understand it and clear your doubts. Let's see the first one, adverb that tells how. First one is, you should read the book. Carefully. The children were reading loudly. Sarah writes neatly. She climbed the mountain slowly. I ate my dinner quickly. Children, just focus. The words like carefully. Loudly, neatly, slowly and quickly. 
these words tell us how the particular action happened the manner okay now let's see the next one here we'll be discussing about adverb that tells when okay let's see the first example we will go to the park tomorrow i will talk to you later riva gets up late in the morning dash is my birthday today the results were announced yesterday we will watch a movie tonight now let's focus the words like tomorrow later morning today yesterday and tonight tells us when an action happened or when an action is going to happen okay now let's see the third category adverb that tells where sam is waiting outside sara is playing inside the house she looked for him everywhere ronny ran upstairs to his bedroom let's focus the words like outside inside everywhere upstairs these words tells us where the action happened okay now here are some questions test your knowledge in these you need to underline the adverb in the following sentences i'm going to read first one snails crawl slowly second one the guard blew the whistle loudly third one i will do my work later fourth i will go to the market tomorrow fifth come and sit here number 6 she is standing outside the house just pause the video for a while and solve it yourself you will find the answers at the end of the video children remember most adverb can be made by adding ly to an adjective or verb for example the dress is elegant here elegant is an adjective which describes the noun dress she dresses elegantly here elegantly is an adverb that describes the verb dresses okay now let's see some more examples like quick plus ly quickly next one slow plus ly slowly next one bright plus ly becomes brightly okay now let's see the answers of the questions first one is snails crawl slowly next one the guards blew the whistle loudly third one i will do my homework later fourth i will go to the market tomorrow fifth come and sit here number 6 she is standing outside the house in the first two sentences 
the word slowly and loudly tells us how the action happened the manner and in the example number 3 and 4 you can see later and tomorrow tells us when and number 5 and 6 tells us where thank you for learning with us i hope it was very informative for you in my next video i'll be uploading some more types of adverb so do watch it